Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. At the Defense Services Asia DSA 2024 in Malaysia, the unveiling of a new iteration of the ACV-300 Adnan, now equipped with the Spy Ball Optical Unit, marked a milestone in the Vehicle's Life Extension Program LEP. This enhancement is particularly noteworthy for the Malaysian Army, where the Infantry Combat Vehicle ICV, holds a pivotal role in various operations. Co-developed by Turkish company FNSS and DefTech, the ACV-300 is based on the ACV-15, an amphibious armored combat vehicle. Malaysia's initial order of 267 units of the ACV-15 in different configurations, starting in 2000, has been entirely fulfilled, solidifying the vehicle's reputation and utility in the field. The ACV-300 is propelled by a 300-horsepower Detroit Diesel 6V53T engine, delivering commendable performance with a maximum road speed of 65 km per hour forward and 11 km per hour in reverse. Its 416-liter fuel capacity ensures extensive range and mobility, while the filtered transmission system guarantees optimal functionality across diverse terrains. In terms of protection, the current iteration of the ACV-300 can withstand 14.5mm caliber armor-piercing rounds. Nevertheless, it offers options for enhancements, including additional armor kits and internal spall liners, which elevate its defense against 30mm caliber rounds and rocket-propelled grenades such as the RPG-7 equipped with anti-armor explosive-shaped charges. A defining feature of the ACV-300 is its sharpshooter turret, engineered for a single operator and armed with a 25mm automatic cannon. This stabilized turret supports the integration of various weapon systems, including a 25mm M242 Bushmaster cannon, a 40mm grenade launcher, or a 12.7mm machine gun, accompanied by a coaxial 7.62mm machine gun. Equipped with a day-slash-night aiming system, featuring a thermal imager and a laser rangefinder for the gunner, the turret enables firing on the move through its electric drive system. Through a collaborative effort between DefTech and Thales, the integration of the Spy Ball Optronic payload into the ACV-300 ICV has been achieved, marking a significant stride in the Life Extension Program, LEP. The Spy Ball boasts a suite of high-definition, multispectral sensors tailored for intelligence and surveillance missions across diverse operational landscapes. Leveraging advanced image processing algorithms akin to those utilized in the Rafaeli Reconnaissance Pod, the Spy Ball ensures optimized image acquisition and processing, essential for tactical endeavors. Equipped with an uncooled infrared thermal camera and a high-definition day camera, the Spy Ball offers comprehensive coverage day and night, complemented by continuous optical zoom for precise long-range target identification. Its integrated laser facilitates target designation up to 2 kilometers, bolstering the vehicle's target acquisition capabilities. Further expanding operational capabilities, the Spy Ball XR, Extended Ranges, variant enables target detection up to 7 kilometers through its day and infrared channels, fostering increased discretion in sensitive areas. Moreover, the Spy Ball IRT and IRZ variants introduce specialized functionalities tailored for specific missions. The IRT incorporates a laser rangefinder to ensure precise target geolocation, whereas the IRZ offers continuous optical zoom for extended range identification, capable of detecting NATO tanks up to 3 kilometers away. In essence, the integration of the Spy Ball Optronic payload into the ACV-300 vehicle significantly amplifies the reconnaissance and surveillance capabilities of the Malaysian Army, furnishing them with a decisive tactical edge on the battlefield. With its advanced performance attributes and operational adaptability, the Spy Ball contributes indispensably to the security and efficacy of military endeavors. That's all for now. See you later.